Prince Harry is set to visit the UK in May for the 10th anniversary of his Invictus Games, and this may include a brief meeting with a forgiving King Charles III. It won't be quite so difficult for Harry to see his father, although that relationship is also fraught with pain and a sense of grievance, royal author Tom Quinn dished. But Charles knows Harry had a difficult childhood for which he, Charles, was partly responsible and so he is more forgiving than William, he added. This insight comes amid reports suggesting the king is making contingency plans regarding the senior royals that will help him fulfill the monarchy's tasks during his treatment for an undisclosed type of cancer. Prince Harry is nowhere to be found on this list. This omission led royal expert Katie Nicholl to share, the idea of Harry coming back to the UK to carry out engagements on behalf of the king is highly, highly unlikely. There is a carefully mapped out contingency plan in place if the king is unable to carry out public-facing engagements over the coming months, and none of these involve Prince Harry. The Duke of Sussex, along with Meghan Markle, infamously left the monarchy in early 2020 in a scandal that is forever known as Megxit. Prince Harry is reportedly set to sporadically return to the UK to help King Charles III during his continuing cancer treatment. Friends of the Montecito Duke have told an outlet that the fifth in line to the throne will even work as a typical senior royal during these visits, breaking his four-year-long absence from the royal stage. Speaking on Good Morning America on February 16, the fiery-haired prince shared, I have got many trips planned that will take me through the UK or back to the UK, so I will my family as much as I can. When asked by one of the hosts to share his outlook on His Majesty's health, the Duke of Sussex replied, that stays between me and him. The brothers are barely speaking so the idea of William wanting Harry to come back and represent the firm is both laughable, and unthinkable. A royal insider dished. The advice was for Harry to leave it a while and come to see his father in Sandringham while he was recuperating, but there was a big rush for Harry to come and see his father. It was all very last minute hence why the meeting was so short. There was no mention of Prince William, who is believed to have made it a point to stay far away from his youngest brother during the February 6, 45-minute reunion between the King and Harry. Daily Express reported on Quinn's comments.